at a high level, what the relay provides to organizations is, is fairly clear. It creates an ability for you to not only get rid of the perimeter and move it inbound so that you provide a high level of security and focus on your resources, but obviously gives you the flexibility now for IP mobility and resource mobility. Moving systems from the physical world to the virtual to cloud becomes easy and requires very little configuration change in an environment because the relay makes it possible for the connections to come from anywhere, whether it's a cloud, internal, hardware, virtual, or even someone sitting in Starbucks. It also makes it realistic to have user-to-user -user connectivity or user-to-server connectivity. Even someone driving along in a car can now communicate with someone sitting in a Starbucks, something that today is almost impossible to do or impractical, actually. Now you can create connectivity between locations that before were not feasible to connect together. Right? So whether I'm on a boat trying to connect to a system in my data center, it doesn't require the IT administrators to create a lot of changes, policies, file rule changes just for me that inherently will stay there forever or because people operationally may not be able to remember that they have to remove changes they made in enterprise. The relay makes the enterprise cleaner, safer, more secure, and it does in a way that's incredibly easy.